Light plays an important role in our lives. The use of artificial light has been revolutionized by the light bulb, and more recently by small energy-saving light-emitting diodes. Think about the possibilities of a light source that is 3D printable, flexible, and readily integrated into a wide range of devices. In their recent paper in Advanced Materials, Professor Hong Meng from Peking University Shenzhen Graduate School, Professor Ray H. Bowman from the University of Texas at Dallas, Professor Wei Huang from Northwestern Polytechnical University and Nanjing Tech University, China, and their co-workers demonstrate a new geometry for electroluminescent devices. Instead of relying on transparent electrodes, a polar liquid or solid is used to emit light. A variety of remotely readable, spatially responsive, light-emitting sensors is successfully constructed using this approach. In contrast to a conventional sandwich electroluminescent light source, or ELS, the researchers designed a novel coplanar electrode structure. The electrode bridged ELS consists of two separate silver electrode layers that are separated from the zinc sulfide phosphor by a barium titanate dielectric. Large area flexible devices equipped with electrodes spaced by 400 micrometers produce light locally, provided that the electrodes are effectively bridged by a polar solvent like water. The researchers attribute the occurring luminescence to a dramatically increased electric field in the phosphor layer, caused by the polarized bridging molecules. Tight electrode spacing results in tight light source spacing, and stable bridging is achieved by a wide range of polar solvents and even strokes of a graphite pencil. Two 4mm wide, 78mm long half ELS cells connected to a power supply and immersed in separate beakers of deionized water only produce light after being bridged by a slab of polyacrylamide hydrogel. Even interdigitated circular electrodes are accessible via the printable phosphor, resulting in attractive light source shapes that can be printed directly on umbrella fabric and act as direct sensors for rain and ice, which produces lower luminescence. The panels can light up on touch or can display elaborate paintings generated from water and coal seed oil. Recently, the researchers have also successfully applied the new coplanar electrode device structure in both organic light-emitting diodes and polymer light-emitting diodes. To learn more about this highly versatile electroluminescent device, please visit the Advanced Materials homepage.